Hey, what's up guys? It's Luke W coming back at you again today. We're sipping a little beer by here, but uh, got my buddy with me. We're out here in Seattle, Washington. I just kind of wanted to show you guys a little bit about what the average mind guy kind of graduating college is looking for in his life right now. 23 to 25 year olds, anyone in this range, you know, like could be starting an online business, could be jumping into a career. Any one of these things is like in the mindset of anyone here. So I want to ask you right now, uh, what's your name, buddy? I'm Tom. So we got Tom here with us today. Tom, is there uh, a career you have in plan for yourself right now or what's going on, man? No, I don't really have a career. Um, so I'm 23 years old. About two years ago, I dropped out of school mainly to pursue music, um, which is fun. Did some tours and stuff, you know, had some fun, played some shows. Uh, but now I'm kind of looking for like a new way to make money, basically like make some more money to support what I'm doing. Been thinking about going back to school, but also been thinking about other options. So it's kind of where I'm at. You know, I mean, that's what I feel like a lot of people are thinking about these days. Like what? what can I do to make more money? And I mean, now that you see the internet, Amazon FBA, like I'm making sales overnight, things are happening overnight. I mean, uh, so like, that's, that's just one thing you guys can be doing. I mean, Tom's, Tom's looking and doing this and pretty much what, what do you think can set you free from doing this? What would you tell people to look at in comparison to like college yeah. to, uh, like, what people are making with this kind of thing like you were telling me earlier yeah so you're saying okay so basically my my idea with why i might be interested in pursuing something like this is um when you kind of look at the average income of somebody who graduates from college versus the average income who of somebody who follows um a business model like this appropriately is just uh it's just there's an enormous difference because the person who is able to successfully follow a model like what Luke has here is going to be making a substantial amount more than the person who just has a degree in liberal arts, which is, I think, you know, it's where a lot of people are at. If you go into tech, yeah, maybe you're making a little bit more money, but you know, speaking for people coming from a liberal arts perspective, this is probably a better, better bet. And you know, the best thing about this is pretty much like you can have your passion in that long run, like liberal arts, making music or whatever you want to do. You can do all this stuff at the same time you're making money during your sleep. All you literally need to do is source a product that's making high profits and you just rank it on Amazon and you're making sales. So that's the whole point of having an online business where you can work anywhere in the world. You can have a real job. And I mean, that's that's the upside to me. I mean, what do you see is like kind of the upside of this and just, I mean, yeah, anything else like. Um. I mean, you kind of, you went over a lot of it. I'd say the main thing is like the freedom with something like this, you know, someone at my age, I'm 23, like I'm looking to go travel a little bit. I'm looking to change my locale. I've been in Seattle for like the past four or five years or so, and I'm looking to explore the world, but you need money to do that. So I think a good thing with this is you can be anywhere in the world and you can have the same business set up and you can just keep hopping around. So. That's where I'm coming from. That's exactly right. So I think with that, we'll conclude, maybe add some more clips into this video, but thanks a lot, Tom. Yeah, thanks, Luke. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.